Happening today, Evanston's full city council is coming together to decide whether to rebuild Northwestern's Ryan Field. CBS 2's Darius Johnson is live right now with more on the support and opposition ahead of tonight's vote. Good morning, Darius. Good morning, Ryan and Dana. I can tell you there's been a lot of back and forth over this ever since Northwestern decided to unveil this $800 million project more than a year ago. Go ahead and take a look. This is what the new Ryan Field could look like. The 35,000 seat stadium would host fans during the football season and during the offseason potentially host up to six concerts, bringing the city nearly $80 million in revenue yearly. But that would require the land to be rezoned and some are not on board with that, including the Evanston Land Land Commission, who advised against rezoning last month. Northwestern responded to the opposition by offering a $100 million benefit package to support Evanston City Services and programs. While some support the economic boost, others argue the neighborhood would suffer from congestion and noise during the offseason. Now that meeting is set for 5 o'clock tonight. If the ordinance is passed, the near century old stadium would be demolished and Northwestern would begin to break ground on that new stadium, a new Ryan Field, which is slated to be complete in 2026. We're live in the Streetside studio this morning. I'm Darius Johnson, CBS 2 News. Darius, thank you.